An interest rate derivative is a derivative where the underlying asset is the right to pay or receive a notional amount of money at a given interest rate. These structures are popular for investors with customized cash flow needs or specific views on the interest rate movements and are therefore usually traded OTC. See Financial Engineering The interest rate derivatives market is the largest derivatives market in the world. The Bank for International Settlements estimates that the notional amount outstanding in June 2012 were 494 trillion US dollars for OTC interest rate contracts and 342 trillion US dollars for OTC interest rate swaps. According to the International Swaps and Derivatives Association, 80% of the world's top 500 companies as of April 2003 used interest rate derivatives to control their cash flows. This compares with 75% for foreign exchange options, 25% for commodity options and 10% for stock options. Modeling of interest rate derivatives is usually done on a time-dependent multi-dimensional lattice built for the underlying risk drivers, usually domestic or foreign short rates and foreign exchange market rates, and incorporating delivery and day count conventions. See short rate model. Specialized simulation models are also often used. Types. Equals vanilla equals. The basic building blocks for most interest rate derivatives can be described as vanilla, interest rate swap, interest rate cap or interest rate floor, interest rate swaption, bond option, forward rate agreement, interest rate future, money market instruments, cross currency swap. Equals quasi vanilla equals, the next intermediate level is a quasi vanilla class of derivatives, examples of which are, range accrual swap bonds, in arrears swap constant maturity swap or constant treasury swap derivatives, interest rate swap based upon two floating interest rates. Equals exotic derivatives equals, building off these structures are the exotic interest rate derivatives, such as, power reverse dual currency note, target redemption note, CMS steepener, 1, snowball, inverse floater, strips of collateralized mortgage obligation, ratchet caps and floors, Bermudan swaptions, Cross-currency swaptions, most of the exotic interest rate derivatives are structured as swaps or notes, and can be classified as having two payment legs, a funding leg and an exotic coupon leg. A funding leg usually consists of series of fixed coupons or floating coupons plus fixed spread. An exotic coupon leg typically consists of a functional dependence on the past and current underlying indices and sometimes on its own past levels, as in snowballs and TARNs. The payer of the exotic coupon leg usually has a right to cancel the deal on any of the coupon payment dates, resulting in the so-called Bermudan exercise feature. There may also be some range accrual and knockout features inherent in the exotic coupon definition. Example of interest rate derivatives. Equals interest rate cap equals, an interest rate cap is designed to hedge a Campania Euro unregistered trademark s maximum exposure to upward interest rate movements. It establishes a maximum total dollar interest amount the hedger will pay out over the life of the cap. The interest rate cap is actually a series of individual interest rate caplets, each being an individual option on the underlying interest rate index. The interest rate cap is paid for upfront, and then the purchaser realizes the benefit of the cap over the life of the contract. Equals range accrual note equals, suppose a manager wish to take a view that volatility of interest rates will be low. He or she may gain extra yield over a regular bond by buying a range accrual note instead. This note pays interest only if the floating interest rate stays within a predetermined band. This note effectively contains an embedded option which, in this case, the buyer of the note has sold to the issuer. This option adds to the yield of the note. In this way, if volatility remains low, the bond yields more than a standard bond equals Bermudan swaption equals, suppose a fixed coupon callable bond was brought to the market by a company. The issuer however, entered into an interest rate swap to convert the fixed coupon payments to floating payments. Since it is callable however, the issuer may redeem the bond back from investors at certain dates during the life of the bond. If called, this would still leave the issuer with the interest rate swap. Therefore, 
The issuer also enters into Bermudan swaption when the bond is brought to market with exercise dates equal to callable dates for the bond. If the bond is called, the swaption is exercised, effectively cancelling the swap leaving no more interest rate exposure for the issuer. See also, Mathematical Finance, Financial Modeling. References Further reading, Leif B. G. Anderson, Vladimir V. Pitlberg. Interest Rate Modeling in Three Volumes. Atlantic Financial Press. ISBN 978-0-9844221-0-4. Damiano Brigo, Fabio Mercurio. Interest Rate Models, Theory and Practice with Smile, Inflation and Credit. Springer Verlag. ISBN 978-3-540-22149-4. John C. Hull Options, Futures and Other Derivatives, 6th edition. Prentice Hall. ISBN 0-13-149908-4, John F. Massell. Dictionary of Financial Engineering. Wiley. ISBN 0-471-24291-8 External links, Basic Fixed Income Derivative Hedging, article on financial-edu.com Interest Rate Modeling by Erl Anderson and B. Pitlberg